An example of the damage, ODOT had its reader boards on I-84 covered in spray paint. It estimates cleanup cost nearly $25,000. Investigators say the same tagger hit other locations, and today he appeared in court. 30-year-old Marcus Gunther is facing criminal mischief charges. Prosecutors say they captured Gunther on surveillance video. Graffiti is a serious, ongoing problem in Portland. Last year, the city had more than 5,000 complaints reported by neighbors and local businesses. We get hit uh, by graffiti probably at least once a week, if not um, uh, once every two weeks. And as you can see from looking at our wall, every place that we've had to paint over is a different color. Taggers hit every corner of the city, spray painting walls and buildings. It certainly seems to be increasing quite a bit. Portland Graffiti Removal works as a contractor with the city to clean up the mess. The faster customers and property owners can get it cleaned up, the less likely it is to continue in that neighborhood or on that street. Investigators admit taking down one suspected vandal helps, but it certainly doesn't wipe out the problem. Because it is every day, constant work every day. And cleanup isn't cheap. The city estimates each and every incident costs roughly $225 to clean up. Typically that bill goes to local residents or local business owners.